Hello, this is Brian Anderson, and I'm going to give you a demo of the program script I wrote for acquiring images on the Hitachi TEM with the AMT image acquisition software. So this is our old scope, and I'm going to show you the old way first. So when we do a job, uh, the first thing we would do would be to create a new folder for the job test for the images. It's how we store our images. Uh, and then, of course, the old way is this is a live image. You click acquire. Slow and old. File. Save as. And you would type in here whatever your. This is where we put our sample and job information. Press save with caption. Then we go find that folder that you created. Go in there. And the way we would name our samples is, you know, Sam. Then I put the magnification that I was taking at 700x, and it might be the first sample. And then we do save. And then we go back to live. And now we'd have, you'd have to reference our sample database to get that sample ID. So what I did was I created my own program that all the stuff on the left there is our uh, database, sample database. Essentially, it's just used to get the uh, sample ID. And what I have is a button that we press that takes the sample ID, uh, initiates a script that automates all the acquisition, uh, or oh, creates the folder, for you based on your job and sample information. And it does so. We go click. Integrating. Wiring. See everything pop up. Save as. And then over here on this right side is essentially just a uh, folder watcher. So it's keeping an eye on what was created. It created that folder that image in and that's it and you've gone back to live. So now you move around wherever, find your next area of interest, hit the button, wait a few seconds, let's see if it Boink. Done. So the idea was to save all the typing and the clicking and the creating of folders and all that uh, just to be a little more efficient. And the details are it's a Visual Basic program that I wrote that interfaces with scripting language called AutoHotKey, which is uh, open source software for automating, you know, window interactions, clicking, moving, typing, all that sort of thing. So that's it. Hope you liked it. Goodbye.